This is the outside view of the new manufacturing unit 4. The new unit will be primarily used for crude API manufacturing. It's connected to final API unit 3 to guarantee controlled handling and lean logistics. This is the view of the charging floor level. All surfaces are easy to clean as we only use stainless steel and epoxy mass on the surfaces. Here, process operators start to handle OEB3 classified material. These reactors can be charged by using laminar airflow cabinets. The materials to be charged from laminar airflow cabinets can be handled in continuous liner bags or drums of different sizes. Now we're in the production side of the main reactor hall. There we have eight reactors together. Here we can handle OEB 4-level APIs in the main reactor hall. For production of highly potent compounds of OEB 5-level, we've built two separate modules inside of Unit 4. The plant is highly automated with minimal manual steps. Control panels are on the floor as well as in the main control room. All material information and safety checks are done through a barcode system utilizing an automation system, SAP, measuring systems, etc. We can say we're going towards a paperless factory. Highly contained handling is built into our operational processes. Even smaller product quantities, for example seeds, can be handled with special techniques up to OEB level 5. The whole plant is highly automated from charging to recovery, especially at units 3 and 4. Here you can see one of our Hastelloy centrifuges. All centrifuges are located in separate production rooms. Highly contained discharging is done using continuous liners. OEB 4 to 5 materials are charged using isolators. Unit 4 has isolators, glove boxes, for powder, liquid and seed handling, as well as for unloading filter dryers. Here you can see a process operator using one of the glove boxes for OEB4 classified material. Vacuum dryers are charged from the isolator using powder transfer system in a vacuum. Discharging of dryers is performed by a continuous liner inside a cross-flow cabinet. Here you can see the technical side of the main process hall. All technical sections are separated from the production area. They're easy to keep clean, which prevents possible cross-contamination and also improves safety when maintenance work is done. Our Hanko plant has several filter dryers. Here is one line of final API sieving and packing. The whole operation is done in a closed system. The product doesn't come into contact with open air during the entire operation. Final API is packed and sampled in a highly contained system. Here you can see the final packing line with a sampling system. Samples are collected straight from the product flow to a sample bottle. Thank you for participating in the virtual tour of Unit 4. Fermions Hanko site.